Why did I accept God? I'll tell you why I accepted God and why I accepted Jesus. Now everybody has their own religion, everybody has their own philosophy, and I've mentioned my own philosophy and my own six commandments. My six commandments were inspired by the Ten Commandments um, by Moses on the mountain, um, asking God, you know, what, what do I do? What laws do I make? And uh, Jesus had the grace. I accepted Jesus because I needed the grace along with the laws. Well, the reason I accepted God and the Lord on August 6th, 2022, was because I felt like I was at a really low point where the only thing on this planet was sin. The only reality was sin. The only reality was death. The only reality was negativity. The only reality was lust. The only reality was anger. The only reality was jealousy. The only reality was uh, sloth. The only real reality was, you know, anything negative, anything with no regard. I have, I have the definition of evil that I looked up. Um, having no regard, no regard for people's feelings. You know, just an example, no regard for people's well-being, no regard for uh, beauty, no regard for love, no regard for love as it really is, no regard for brotherly love, sisterly love, no regard for uh, empathy, no regard for anything that's good on earth and in the universe. So that's why I accepted God. My mom said that God made us, and since I was an atheist and since I still am, um, I didn't see God. I didn't. There wasn't a God there. There wasn't a uh, a man or a woman there. But it's funny, the idea that there was a divine force um, that I didn't even have to understand. I, I came to believe that I didn't even have to understand it. Long after I became an adult, I realized I did not have to really understand what or who or she he or she was. But um, I knew that. Um, if I accepted this philosophy, this um, idea, I could recover from my uh, mental illness better. I could uh, have a spiritual basis. Um, I also realized that I am a soul with a body, not just a body with a soul, not just a body either. With God, I realized I'm not just a body, I'm not just a woman, I'm not just a, uh, a being on earth. And um, when I got um, when I got snarked at, now I I understand they had an opinion on YouTube. I even honored that opinion, but I had to keep a distance from it because the way they said it, I thought was kind of had no regard for my feelings. Oh oh, Jesus wasn't a weatherman. That was during the Herrick, the um, storm last summer, um, Hillary. And um, the reason I got so insulted by it was because. I was truly, genuinely expressing my gratitude for this divi divinity that saved me and my roommate from having an absolute flood. And I was praying for the others that had floods going on during Hillary. I felt like this person on YouTube had no regard for my feelings or for my uh, welfare and my roommate's welfare. It's like they really literally didn't care. They just thought it was fun to um, make fun of my, my belief my newfound belief, and um, God bless them, and God forgive them, and Lord forgive them, because um, that's the only way I can deal with it. I really truly believe I can love everyone, but some I have to love from a distance, because it's not safe to be close to them if they're going to have no regard, if they're going to be with uh, the evil force, and the evil force, I believe, is embodied in Satan. Um... I think he was an angel, but not all angels are good. Um, some really did believe in uh, having power. And um, the power, if, if we turn the power over to God, and um, if we live in God, and that means loving one another, that means loving everyone from a distance or otherwise. If It, it means um, sharing, sharing the wealth on the planet. Um, to the point where we all get our needs met instead of having this lack mentality of there's not enough to go around especially with social programs there isn't enough to go around blah 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 well that's what you think um, with that kind of an attitude you will not have any problem solving abilities 
you will not have any problem solving abilities. Um, there was somebody who wrote in the book, Came to Believe, um, said something like, if we have a spiritual basis, now I'm saying it in my own words, if we have a spiritual basis, all of our needs will be provided for. Now, it might take longer for those needs to be provided for. We want instant uh, gratification. Now, my first commandment in my six commandments goes like this. I look upon others with gratitude, not, not for seeking gratification. In the super positive version, I wrote um, gratitude, look upon others with gratitude. Um, and the older version uh, had, had the negativity validation in there, and it said not seeking gratification. A lot of us want to seek gratification. Um, many rich people, maybe not all of them, some of them have good hearts, I believe that. But uh, many rich people, um, especially a few people I can name that I won't, um, believe that um, they need more money. They always need more money, even if they have more than enough. Um, they want gratification in money. They want gratification in maybe a new car all, every, every year, every month or whatever. And uh, God forgive them. That's their idea of security. But um, my roommate and I don't have a car. We could probably use at least an old clunker right now to get around. He can still drive if he gets a driver's license again. He's 74 years old, but I bet if he had a car and a driver's license, he would, he would try to drive again. He would. I know it. I've known him for 40 years. So um, my point, I didn't know I was going to go so long, almost 10 minutes, but that is why I accepted the idea of God. I believe that we can believe whatever we want. As I mentioned before, um, whether they knew it or not, Joseph and Mary chose to believe that the Archangel, Ga Archangel Gabriel came along and told them that, told them that um, they shall get married and have, have the baby, the unborn baby, named Jesus. So, um, we can believe whatever we want, ladies and gentlemen. We can believe and have no, we can believe in something and have no regard for anyone, any feelings, any goodness, any well-being, any welfare, any beauty, or we can believe in God. Have a good day, everyone. That's the way I believe in God.